This is a GCS News Break. Thank you all so much for letting us get to know you. GCS valedictorians, salutatorians, and honor graduates joined Superintendent Sharon Contreras at High Point University for a luncheon to celebrate their achievements. About 30 students, accompanied by their parents and principals, were recognized for their hard work throughout their years in Guilford County Schools. The goal of becoming valedictorian, it wasn't even in my mind until I reached 11th grade, and that's when I figured out I was in the running for it. So, yeah, it's still so crazy to think about. It wasn't expected at all. I'm very proud because there haven't been any Val Sal's in my family, so I'm the first one I hope to you know, just start a new chain of new events going down for the future generations. This was definitely a goal of mine. Uh, my grandmother was actually valedictorian for high school, and so I wanted to do it uh, like her, to be like her. Um, but I just took advantage of every opportunity that came my way and just ran with it. There were a lot of hard nights. A lot of times I didn't think it would be possible, but I pulled it out. It took a lot of work. It took a lot of late nights. It took a lot of phone calls. But one thing I do know is that with my family, they've been there with me every step of the way. We can build a beautiful city. Weaver Academy junior Lark Muller sang Beautiful City from the musical Godspell. And following lunch, each student had the opportunity to introduce themselves and share their plans for the future. I plan to go to Princeton University and study public policy. Um, I probably want to go to law school and become like an international lawyer, so that's my plan. I'm headed towards NC State University uh, with a biomedical engineering intent, but I am in the engineering school already. Um, and I want to either make prosthetics or learn how to like, help make vaccines and medicines that can kind of help with what we're going on with today. Congratulations again to all the Vals and Sals in the class of 2021. This has been a GCS News Break. <laughs>